Hey guys, what's up? So, I have a problem with one of my work laptops here. Um, actually, my kids spilled coke on this here day, and the keys are, are like stuck. So, like when I hit the F key, it hits the C key, and I, this laptop's not even usable. So, um, I did order another uh, keyboard online, Amazon, like 17 bucks. So, let's check this out. Okay, so that's good. Cool thing is by being able to see the old one or this one that's new, uh, it tells me basically how this thing comes off. So that's the keyboard. It looks like it's held on by two screws. And once I get those two screws off, I should just be able to pop it up and replace the ribbon cable. It doesn't look new to me. Well, I don't care as long as the keys work. <laughs> yeah, because I have to go and uh, do some router programming right now, and I don't have a laptop, so. At least my other one's not finished, so I got a new laptop, and I'll show you that in another video. So I'm going to replace this laptop with another, a new laptop, but I need to haul ass. So let's see in relation. I know that there's one here, and there must be one under this memory cover. So let's do that. Hopefully this will be the world's quickest keyboard change. Yeah, because there has to be... Here and there. Is there uh, let me put a catch down here? Okay, so there's a screw right there. So that's exactly where it would be. So it looks like there's one down here. You can still see if you're still in the frame. Uh, and then one here. Lose that. Right, let's see here. Now, that's all. Oh, shit. Okay, yeah. Um, get my screen in here, guys. Oh, I'll turn it on. I'll do that. Oh, it's already on. So, as you can see, that was an accident. <laughs> all right. Let's see if I can get this damn keyboard up now. This should just pop up this way. Let's see. Okay, and so I ripped the cable off. Well, the thing came off at the same time. Normally I would. I have to be more careful, but I'm in a serious hurry because I got I have to be on site to do a phone system turn up here. And the next couple minutes, so this ribbon cable goes down in there. If you can see that, I don't know if you can see that. I probably won't. But there's a ribbon cable there, and it goes in that connector right there. Make sure before I put it back together that it actually works. Yeah, actually having the old, having the one so I could see where the screws were at, definitely helped out in the speed of this thing. But this cable looks oh, it has a protector thing on it, this little plastic thing, and this one doesn't. Let's see. Well, I'm going to do log on my password real quick so you don't see it. Well, <laughs> well, I guess I'll flip it this way so you don't see it. Maybe you can still see it. I don't know. Whatever. Okay, I'll come over here. Yay, logged in. Turn the laptop off. 
need to turn it off. All right, um, that's not important. It did actually work. I was able to log in. So, put the keyboard screws back in. And that was probably the world's quickest laptop keyboard replacement I've ever done. I've done a lot of these, so awesome. So it took me about five minutes. I don't even know if that five ten minutes. All right, guys, cool, awesome. Back in business.